welcome to Max M Guitars episode 4. So as you remember in the last episode we put this oil on the neck and it's starting to look good. Since then I've put on another couple of coats. So what the next job is if you're making this at home, we are going to run our fingers along the neck and if you feel any rough parts you're going to get the steel wool and just run it over gently. So the next thing we'll do is put the Maxim logo in the net on the head, but that'll be in, in another episode. This episode will be mainly about preparing the body for the paint. We're going to be using Montana spray paint. First is going to be a primer coat. Next is going to be a red orange base coat. Next is going to be a really cool crackle effect black. And last we're going to have a clear varnish over the top. First we are going to mask off the parts that we don't want painted. Using some sort of old pizza box we are going to cut um, pieces of card that will fit in the holes. And using the masking tape we will stick them in. Let's get started on that. So in this job we are going to be putting the masking tape around the edges of the hole but just under it but first we need to put this in at the bottom instead of just masking taping the whole thing so now we move on to the masking tape This isn't really an exciting part, so we'll come back once we've done this bit. So that's us masked off the holes for the pickups and the hole for the neck and for the electronics. The reason we don't want paint in the holes is because we are going to put copper tape. Copper tape will prevent interference. So in the next episode we will hopefully be doing the painting. But since we live in Scotland it needs to be the right temperature to do the painting. It needs to be the right temperature to cure properly. That's all for now. Thank you for watching Max and Katara's episode 4 to the end. Like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video.